I should like to cross also, sir. Why don't you wait for the guns? Because if I open my mouth again about the loading of the guns, Glover will go mad. He hates me. I tried to talk to him about this before, but, well, he insulted me. How? He said that in an army that hasn't eaten in three months, it's damn near treason to be fat. Use your goddamn head, Mr. Knox. Glover, you're a sour, foul-mouthed barbarian. That I am. By God, that I have lived to hear John Glover apologize? Uh -huh. Fire! Oh. at the same time. Most nights he's out scavenging through abandoned houses looking for stuff to sell. How long has he lived here? A couple months. After the floods, he went to Ohio, stayed with an aunt. Then he came back to New Orleans to look for his dad. Did he have some reason to think that his father was alive? I don't think so. I just get the feeling that without the body, it's just been really hard for him to deal with everything. How about this guy? The FEMA guy? <laughs> he was here yesterday. He doesn't work for FEMA. Why would anybody pretend they did? That's a good way to get your ass kicked. Well, what did he want? He said Jess had some money coming. I asked him if there was any money for me, and he just said no. And that was it? He wanted to know what bar Jess might be headed to. I gave him a couple of ideas, and he left. Pardon me. explosion finished them off, but no food, no water, won't last long. I didn't think I set off two explosions. Too bad you can hear that nitro from miles away, huh? Where am I supposed to bike? In a tree? <laughs> hey, me got tree! Hey, screw you, Frenchie! I won't guess I get it if I don't because I wanna <laughs>